look, the drone wars, uh, th this, is, this is, it's not an example of, uh, and, and I think this is true with the NDAA, I think it's true with the FISA Amendment Act, I think all, we go all the way back. What they're attempting to do is legally justify what they're already doing. They have argued uh, that under the 2001 authorization to use military force act, they have a right to assassinate American citizens. I have read that act innumerable times, and uh, Bruce and Carl did, and none of us find that in the act. Uh, that is, uh, at, to be generous, a radical interpretation of the AUMF. And so what they're seeking to do is legally justify in the same way that you uh, was attempting to legally justify torture, uh, they're essentially looking for kind of legal cover. Um, and so I think it's all connected. Uh, it, it's all a part of uh, this very rapid descent into a frightening form of total corporate totalitarianism. Uh, and that is just writ large across the landscape. Uh, and as we go down, and they know we're going down, uh, look, I mean, you know, they, they, these forces are cannibalistic. 40% of the summer Arctic sea ice melts, and here we are literally watching the death throes of the planet, and these corporations like Shell look at it as a business opportunity. Um, they know only one word, and that's more. Uh, they have commodified everything. Human beings are commodities, disposable commodities, the ecosystem is a disposable commodity, and uh, they will they will put now with no impediments they will push and push and push it makes herman melville's moby dick which i'm just rereading the most prescient study of the american character because we're all on the pequod and ahab's running the ship and as ahab said my means and my methods are sane and my object is mad yeah. and uh they're not going to stop themselves the formal mechanisms of power are not going to stop them it's up to us